feelings of low self-worth inspired me to seek re dash relationships with the wrong people i thought i had to drink in order to find connection but drinking only led me to unhealthy connections that ended up lasting years even though i was surrounded by sober people in my family i found the idea of quitting drinking to be unimaginable it felt like if i could do that i could achieve anything i wanted in life i still think this is true besides the physical and psychological dependence i'd have to take on the identity of the addict or alcoholic someone who had to keep this large shameful part of themselves a secret who could no longer have fun or be normal a life of sobriety was a life sentence and a burr dash den i made the first steps to getting sober once the alarm bells from my childhood education about alcoholism got too loud for me to ignore i was drinking earlier and earlier in the day and my de dash depression and anxiety were becoming unmanageable my entire life had been taken over by the when where how and what to drink i was scared that i had to hit my proverbial rock bottom before i quit but that turned out not to be true there were a number of aspects i knew about traditional re dash recovery that i was wary of i am used to doing things on my own and taking care of myself so that's how i was going to do recovery too no fellowship for me i was lucky enough to find an addiction counselor i connected with right off the bat and she was the one who eventually suggested i check out buddhist recovery so i could at least